Good evening. This is Steve Mastretta, and today I have the pleasure of interviewing Jim Kennard, president of the Food for Everyone Foundation. Jim, thank you for taking a moment with us today. You're welcome, Steve. Thanks for your call. Jim, what makes the Mitlider Method organic? There are several reasons the Mitlider Method of gardening is sometimes called the best of organic. Number one, rather than teaching the use of pesticides or herbicides, we use cultural practices to eliminate the need for them. For example, we eliminate all weeds from the beds, the aisles, and even the garden periphery. Number two, we never water the aisles, but keep just the root zone of the plants moist. Number three, we keep plants off the ground and prune plants to maintain good air circulation. Number four, we grow healthy plants fast so they have good resistance to bugs and disease. Number five, we don't use materials that could introduce bugs, weed seeds, or disease into our garden. The second major thing is that we never guess about the nutrients we give our plants. Plant nutrition is too important to guess about. Compost and manure often lack some of the essential plant nutrients. And the gardener never knows what elements are missing from compost and manure. We use a balanced mix of USDA approved natural mineral nutrients. And number three, we harvest our crops at peak maturity and never leave old plants in the garden to attract bugs and disease. Jim, thank you very much for taking a few moments with us today. You're welcome, Steve. My pleasure.